So uh, now that everybody's eaten and hopefully drunk enough to think I'm funny, um, <laughs> I can go ahead and get started. <laughs> EJ, come close to something. Okay, here. yep. Uh, so for those of you who uh, don't know me, uh, my name is EJ, uh, Earl, Jasper, I've gone by a lot of names. Uh, but what's important today is that I was asked to be the best man. <laughs> <laughs> Understanding, clever, and strong willed person in my life than the person sitting before me today. Alright, so now that I'm done talking about Aaron, I guess we can move on to Desmond. <laughs> <laughs> so, Desmond and I have known each other since we were five years old. Um, so, for those of you who paid attention in math class, uh, we've known each other for about 80% of our lives. Uh, we, I remember back in these early days, we used to have uh, like a basically a traveling sideshow on the playground. And our most famous bit is people would come up to us and they would ask us to do impressions of Pokemon from the TV show. <laughs> and uh, we always delivered uh, because frankly, at that age, that is the most logical thing you can think of to get girls to talk to you. Uh, so, and then we're older than us. <laughs> <laughs> so that should tell you two things about Desmond and I right off the bat. One, we were both born performers, and two, neither of us would have a girlfriend for a very, very long time. <laughs> so, fast forward many, many years, uh, Desmond and I did not go to the same college, so when we could get together every six months to a year, uh, we'd meet up at his parents' house, and his parents would put a bottle of gin at the middle of the table and say, we don't want to finish this, you guys have to do it. And Mama didn't raise no quitters. So. Uh, so in order to pass the time, we would tell stories about each other's lives, you know, sort of catch ourselves up. Uh, the only flaw in this plan is as the amount of alcohol in the bottle got less and less, my ability to comprehend Desmond's stories also got less and less. Uh, so fast forward uh, to the next bottle of gin. And Desmond says, hey, you remember that story I told you about those people at that place? And I'm like, yeah, just sort of dismissively as I'm rooting through the Ings uh, kitchen, hoping that there's some leftover food for me in there. <laughs> and Desmond says, Aaron is coming, and I want you guys to meet. And you know that moment when you walk into class, and everybody else has their textbooks out, and you start to panic? And you look at the board, and it says test today. And you think to yourself, I did not realize I was going to be tested on this material. <laughs> and I realized I completely blacked out who Aaron was. <laughs> <laughs> I did not know if Aaron was a girl, a, boy, <laughs> a very fancy trombone. <laughs> Cheers. 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 Cheers.